On the table today at Squirrel Stampede, we have a special live stream event. I'm going to build the Lego Minecraft, the End Arena, the giant Ender Dragon head sculpture with a little bit of a tussle, tuffle, tussle or tuffle? What's the word for a little scrumble, a fight in front of the Ender Dragon? So this is kind of a surprise uh, jump into live. Usually I kind of like let people know but this is indeed live. So hello, people. Thank you for joining in. I'm just setting up right now. So give me give me a few seconds to figure out what I'm trying to do today. Uh, how's everyone doing today? It's President's Day. And I thought, you know what? I'd like to build this Ender Dragon set live because there's not that many pieces. And it seems like a really easy way to um, work on it in a live video. So... Yeah, thought it would be a little bit fun. So I'm just kind of getting things ready right now. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Let's see here. Do -do 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 -do. There we go. Okay, I've got myself into my chat now. And let's see, I gotta, gotta move the camera around. Uh, welcome, welcome, everybody. Welcome to a live build of the Lego Minecraft The End Arena President's Day Edition. I should give a um, president's hat to um, Abraham Lincoln there, or um, Dragonite, but I can't find my hat. Tiny Chipmunk ran off with it. Oh, there it is. Tiny Chipmunk, may I borrow your hat, please? Oh, that's a lot of blue stuff under your head. Okay, let's take that off real quick. I was shocked I do not have a Lego uh, Abraham Lincoln build. Put that right there on Dragonite's head. Oh, oh, for two seconds it worked. For two seconds. Okay, so let's get building. Let's get building today. I chose uh, the End Arena. It's a great build for live because it's only 252 pieces, so it shouldn't take more than an hour to build. Maybe a little less, maybe a little more. Inside, we've got a shulker build, which I don't believe I've built a shulker of that scale before. Uh, you don't get many End sets. I mean, I believe we've built a couple Ender Dragon sets, and that's about it. There might be one other set, but very rare you get to the end with Lego Minecraft, so that's exciting. And this is pretty cool because instead of just a dragon, we're getting like a little structure with a dragon. And we've got two warriors. We've got a dragon archer, which looks pretty neat. Uh, enchanted armor there and an end warrior with a really cool um, end shield there. And bless an enderman, an enderman included. So that looks like a terrific build. So, okay, what do we got going on? Um, do, 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 do. Did you see the skins? The seven default skins, says uh, Mick O'Boyan. If I can see it, even say your name right. Um, I have not seen the skins yet. I should keep my eye out for stuff like that more often. Um, I, I, for some reason, am always behind. I'm like two years behind everything. But I should be getting to my 50th Minecraft Minecraft. I like that accent I just threw in there. I should be getting to my 50th gameplay here uh, this week, hopefully. Let me see if I can adjust the camera a little bit better so that we can see this stage. Um, I have the worst tripod. Oh, that works better. That works a lot better. And... Oh, <laughs> I like how it's delayed on my screen over there. This set reminds me so much of this one. Remember the skull? I can't remember the name of this set. I was going to look up the name of this set, but this was a um, cool little battle set too, where you had too many figures uh, throw down in front of a little statue build. And I thought, oh, this, this new one is just back to this. I think every year they should do something like this and this. Like, I love it. I think it's a great idea. Okay, so let's get into the back here. Uh, on the back of the box, we've got an image of what's going on. Doesn't look as large as the former skull set, so, you know, we got a little bit safe uh, space of uh, safe saving space, not a safe space. <laughs> it looks more like a dangerous place to be. Uh, Dragon has an action feature of shooting lava from its nose. And, uh, yeah, some interesting things. There's a potion, a brown, or is that red? No, that's red potion. Some sort of secret door under this thing. That might be that might prove interesting. So we will continue on punching out our door here. Do more Ben 10. I haven't seen much Ben 10 in store right now. Ben 10 is kind of in break right now in between series. 
One of these days that it will return in all its glory. Okay, so two, two packs it looks like. And, oh, instructions. And a void of a box. An empty box. All right, so there we go. Again, thanks everyone for joining in today. Live build President's Day. Pretty fun. Uh, we're going to work on this. We got bag one of pieces. Bag two of pieces. That'll work. I'm just going to go right for it. Get these out. Feels like more pieces than I anticipated. Look at all this. We got a lot of stuff in here. I'm from North Korea. No way. From North Korea? Watching Lego builds at Squirrel Stampede? Pretty impressive. Okay, so what do we got? Um, I'm going to build the Wonder Twins because I see purple purple pants. Wonder Twins being from the Super Friends if you watch the old um, 80s show. I'm American, says Holly Martin. Yay, President's Day. Happy President's Day. Uh, somewhere in here there's a head. Where is the head? Do Treasure X. I'm hoping to get to that Minecraft Treasure X uh, snow series that I kind of missed last year. And then I want to do a review on a lot of my Treasure X sets. So that's coming up in a little bit. Da da da. There we go. There's our first build. And we're going to build a shield. The shield pieces are a little tricky to find. I think we'll just hold off on the shield and just get to the build and we can find the pieces. More SpongeBob. Oh, totally. How come we don't do enough SpongeBob around here? That's also been kind of quiet. Need a, they need a new SpongeBob theme from someone. Predator. Predator, always awesome too. I saw some new Predator figures just recently. Okay, so we are constructing away. Pretty good view, I hope you can see, as we've got the lava field going already. And some sand and stone. Do more Five Nights at Freddy's. I don't have too much Freddy's on the way yet. I know they have some snaps coming. Another series or wave. I have some more um, Poppy playtime coming. I have the action figures. Going to work on those soon. My Singing Monster is such a, such a great one. I wish they did not stop right, at, right when they get going on those musical boxes. Musical figures, they were so neat. All right, so we got our base probably all set to go. And let's see. These tiles are very warm. The lava tiles, you can always feel a little bit more heat on them. Grocery Gang. Yeah, I'm going to be checking out some of the Trash Pack and Grocery Gang on reels. Or not reels, shorts. There's so many different versions of a um, upright video these days. We'll be showing more Grocery Gang and some Trash Pack there occasionally. So keep an eye out for that. It's kind of fun to re revisit those. Building right along. Building right along. What do we got? Two of those. Structure already. This is a nice long beam, but that's not what we're needing. Gonna need this. If anyone has not seen my Big Brain Simulator gameplay over at the Squirrel Stampede Gaming channel, check it out. There's, We do a little bit of Big Brain, and we do some Hide and Seek Extreme. So it's kind of fun to see both. It's really crazy. I'd like to do Blocks Hunt, too, in a little bit, but I only had time for Hide and Seek Extreme. I put this in the wrong spot. This is killing my finger. Yay. Got it. Looking cool. All right, there's there's some more here. There's some. We might be expanding the platform a little more. Oh, I usually put the box back here because people are probably joining in and going, what are you building? What are you working on? Well, we're working on this guy back here. That helps. That helps everyone go. Oh, okay, that's what we're that's what we're working on. If you have just joined in, surprise build today. I was originally planning today. I was actually planning on getting into Earth Spark. 
uh, working on and looking at these great new transformers. A lot of people have been re uh, recommending do Earth Spark and do some transformers. So that was today's plan, and then I realized it's President's Day, and people are home, and people are bored, and people want something now. And so I just thought, oh, this will be fun to do. So Transformers will be coming up soon, too. I've just watched a few Earth Sparks. I'm so behind on shows, as always. More Jurassic Park. There will always be, of course... Jurassic Park's pretty good right now because they just keep pushing out new awesome things. Unlike SpongeBob, right? We're looking for SpongeBob. Can't find any. Okay. More of these go here. The challenge of doing live is like building and reading at the same time. It's a little tricky. Hammond Collection for Jurassic World has been fun. I enjoy those. They're so nice and clean. I imagine there's going to be some new ones soon. I think some people have mentioned some new dinos coming up soon. Anybody have a favorite president they want to list for President's Day? <laughs> I'm sure that would just get all political weird. Okay. My favorite president. I used to have a few, but now I can't remember them. <laughs> Not into politics. You should watch Mano Cyber. I'm not sure what that is. John F. Kennedy. Hey, there you go. Ask not what your country can do, but what you can do for your country. Pretty solid president right there. Okay, let's see Boop, got that going, kind of building this front wall. Yeah, we're building the front wall, but backwards because this will swing around. So the ender head, ender dragon head will fit there a little bit backwards for now. Oh, looking good though, pretty interesting. Dun, da, da, dun, da, da, da. I didn't even set up some music. Sometimes I set some music up in the background. I forgot to do that today. So it's going to be kind of quiet. Quiet and lonely. These are weird. What's going on with this? I need two, two beams, and I don't see them. There they are. Technic stuff. Technic stuff is going to go in here. One there. Oops. One there. It's an interesting build so far. How much does this set cost? This set, oh, I can't think of it on the top of my head. I'm going to guess between 20 and 30 as my guess. Back in the day, this would have been easily 20, but with all the Lego price increases and inflation, I think it's probably could be 25 somewhere in there. Um, it only has 252 pieces. It's a fairly small box. And I'm sure they're marketing this set as a more easily obtainable build. Who's your favorite characters from shows, movies? Skippy's from Mr. Bean fan, Disney. Skippy from Animaniacs and Scrat from Ice Age. <laughs> I haven't watched Animaniacs in a while. It's a good show. Scrat, who's your favorite? Squirrel characters from shows or movies. Uh, Scrat, you know, that probably is your is a really good one. This is weird. I don't know if I built this right yet. Um, this is a little complicated part. You got this little base here, flat brick, uh, bubble brick on the side. What do you call that kind of brick? And a little bit of a thing coming up. I think it's going to come together soon. So that just goes there. Ice Age Squirrel, amazing, right? Scrat, where is my thing there? I just saw Scrat get his, like, finally get his nut or something. That was kind of funny. Do TMNT. I've got a couple turtle shorts coming up because they are re-releasing a lot of the 90s stuff. Um, 
And I do have a couple, I have a couple turtle surprises. I don't know if they'll get a full video just because it would be too, not enough content to run a full video with it, but you might see some turtles pop up soon. It's been kind of turtle quiet lately, the last little bit. All right, here's an interesting contraption. I think I built it right. There are new Ben 10 toys, really. I have not seen those. Okay, so now I need to, what is going on with this? Like this, okay, so these two points, okay, that's not hard. One goes there, one goes through here. Okay, this is hard. This is really hard from this angle. Oh, oh dear. Might have to get a little closer here. Okay, okay. Easy, no squirrel. Oh, it might have been easier to lock that in place than do that one. And then we want this thing kind of on this flat piece there. A little bit of mechanics going on because we're building a secret door. A secret door. Do FNAF Lego. I've seen some really cool off-brand FNAF Lego pieces. I should do one of those sometime. I got Poppy Playtime coming up real soon. Um, and I'm always looking for more FNAF. Okay, getting there. What are you having for lunch? I like that question. That's the best question of the day. Um, right now I'm having, I have like a donut nearby. Um, I just had an applesauce pouch. And for lunch, I will probably have like either a grilled cheese <laughs> or this is the other part of the door, I'm assuming. Either a grilled cheese, you gotta say cheese like that. Or I will be having maybe like half a turkey sandwich. I like half a turkey and then like, I don't know, some other weird things. Good question, I like that one, that was funny. Why didn't you answer me how much it costed? I thought I did it. This set runs approximately, I'm guessing 20 to 30, maybe 25. And got this little flange piece going. Interesting, interesting. And this one, so what I did last time, what I should do this time, it'd be easier just grab this piece lock this into place first, then drop this down onto this post right here, and you should have <laughs> a very weird working mechanism. Oh, okay, the door, it's, it's coming together. Kind of a cool mechanism. That's fun. All right, well, we continue on. Oh, gotta lock that down with a little round Technic washer. What do you call those? And now, this piece should be interesting. This should be cool. So, uh, any other favorite presidents? Um, William, William Henry Harrison. He died in 30 days, according to The Simpsons. I'm William Henry Harrison. Um, anybody from the state? What state did William Henry Harrison come from? That's the quiz today. Anybody want to answer which state? Do, 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 do. Doo, doo. Ah, so here is our lever that's going to activate our door now. Getting better. I think this will seal up once we um, uh, build some extra things on top. That should seal better. All right. And if you're just joining in, everyone, thank you much for joining in today for Live Build, a surprise, a square prize Live Build on President's Day. Typically, I like to announce early what's coming, but it just kind of came to came together this way today. Okay, it's working better. It's working better. See if I can get this closer for you. I could do this like all day. That's fun. It's a little bit wonky still in here, but we'll get it. We'll get it. Dragonite actually really matches this set. We just built the Dragonite set, so if you haven't checked that out, check out the Pokemon builds. A lot of Pachirisus. It was a great build, a lot of fun there. Okay, make sure that's straight. I think I'm missing something right down the center. I just realized, when did I miss that? That's gonna really help things. Wow, that, I missed that a long time ago. I, I, was on, I was on stage, man, that was a long time ago. I'm on like stage 40 and I missed it. It was way back on stage 
22. Okay, 22. So I need, where are they? I need one of these. This is going to help this mechanism so much more. These are so important. They're so critical. So I got that one, this one, and that one. How did I miss that? That was 22, and I'm all the way over here at stage 32. So a whole 10 stages ago, I missed that. And so now these things, there we go. Now the doors are working better. See how they're all nicely sealed in. Look at that. And again, I could do that like 100 million years. That should just be like its own channel. Hey, this guy opens and closes this apparatus from the end arena 100 million times and he hasn't stopped. That's all he does. Okay. Got it. Now I'm building in some more things to keep all these arms and levers securely fashioned inside. So this is your last look at what's inside. This is your last look at the lever. Oh no, oh, I, I wanna see the lever again. Oh, you'll have to go back and rewatch. They have OmniKix Jet Ray for sale. OmniKix Jet Ray. I'll have to check that out. Check it out and see. It's It's been a while since we've gone through anything Ben 10. Okay. All right, so there, we got the little bit of the structure built. Now we're going to build these little towers. Oh, the, the, um, the crystal towers. What do you call the end? Dragon's Tower Pillars, again, we're gonna build two of those. So I might be able to build two at the same time. That might be a little easier. So we start by just getting some blocks ready. Okay, this is a really cool set. This is really cool. Anything from the end, like I was saying earlier, it's rare that LEGO Minecraft gets to the end. Um, we typically always, in the overworld somewhere, very, very rare. A little bit in the nether, very, whoop, bumping my camera, very rare to get into the uh, the end. Now, who wants to tell me what these little purple circles are in this build? Who are, what are these purple circles? Is that an element of the, the, um, the end? Dan, you should play in the end. I agree, Lincoln. Um, we're getting closer, and I gotta do the 50th show. Hopefully this week we'll do a 50th update here. And then we're really gonna start looking for that stronghold like we did last time. And then we'll finally be able to do something in the end. Um, pretty crazy. I've not got to the end on that show. And that's kind of a goal for this year. I think we can do it for this, not even this year, for this, like the next few months. So stay tuned to there. An Omnikix Humongosaur. I almost thought I read Hamburger. Okay, that thingy. And then I'm building two of these. And we'll kind of go like this. I should have had some music going. Why didn't I have some music going? It's so quiet. I can hear my ears ring. Okay, this thing, this thing, the comments are awesome though. Thank you everybody for joining in today as we work on a Lego Minecraft, the end arena, special president's day build. At any point, you may name your favorite president. I think we've so far gone through JFK, William Henry Harrison, and maybe mentioned Abraham Lincoln, and that's about it. So anyone else have a favorite president, just list it in the comments and we'll be happy. We've got a Trump, we've got a Trump. Stickbot Trump hasn't been on the table in a while. I'm so glad we're getting more stuff. A new Ender Dragon, I hope, I hope, yeah. It actually has been a while since the last Ender Dragon, hasn't it? Probably a couple years now. They kept that one set on the shelf for a while. Um, wow, that was like a fail. Ugh. 
gonna reach all the way over there. Okay, so this one, how does this work? This direction, right? I think, I don't know, I may have spun these around. That's right. And then this, this goes, I mean, this is like really nitpicky stuff, getting it exactly like the instructions when it doesn't, it doesn't totally matter. Um, yeah, I definitely did something weird with this one. An entire end city. I agree, that would be a really cool build. We need to see an end city. That hasn't been done. That would be awesome. Do you still have the mountain cave? Yeah, I do. It's right behind me, across my room. It's too big to ever take apart. I wouldn't want to take it apart. It's a great showpiece. Um, and it's fun to put stuff on top of it. Like I have a Snorlax sleeping in front of the cave. Or I did. It seemed to have moved. Oh, I think we have to build a shulker. And here's the shield. So here's some leftover pieces. I, I kind of went ahead because sometimes finding the little pieces at start is so difficult. So here's the shield. And if anyone wants to help me out what this print is, is it like a little shulker? What is that? I don't know what this print is. I hope we get more axolotls and a supercharged creeper. Yeah, they they should be like, they should be flooding these sets with axolotls that based on how popular they are. They should have so many axolotls. Uh, what do you think? Is this netherite? It's a darker gray. It could be a netherite. It's going to be either a netherite or maybe... I think it's too dark to be just iron. Although sometimes netherite's shown in more of a brown, right? Okay, so that was that guy. And now we got to build our little shulker guy. And I don't think I've built this before. I think this is all new to me. So what do we do first? We take this plus this. This piece would have been great in the uh, the warden's area for one of those uh, Skulk Shrieker things. That would have been better. One of these bricks has got our shulker head. There he is. There's our eyes. Can you see him? He's right there. Netherite is a dark gray, same color as shiny rah, something something. That comment just flew by, but yeah, it's it's. Sometimes I've seen it in brown. Oh, this is cool. This this is just gonna fit right over. That is perfect. All these are extra. Um, can I get in a little closer with this one? Will um, will things happen? Okay, so here's your little shulker figure. I think this is new. I think this is a new shulker figure. Uh, it seamlessly fits this little hat or the top of the shulker. It looks like a hat. Just seamlessly fits over and, and hides it. And it's about, I don't know, without this base, it's about the size of a typical 2x2 two two brick, I think. That's pretty neat. I wish they kind of put like two or three of these in here. So you should make you make your best shulker noise. I, you know, honestly, it has been over a year since I've even worked with a shulker or seen one. It's so rare. I can't even remember what it sounds like. That's going to be hard. You can type it up in the comments. What do you think it sounds like? So there's bag one. Bag one, we built this incredibly cool door. We'll flip this around here. And once again, we can see this door function. A little lever in the back. And there's a secret chamber of, well, lava. I guess it's more of a lava drop. That's all it is. It's a trap. It's a trap. There's no... I thought maybe we could hide some items in there, but no, that's a trap. <laughs> so that's that's scary, but but pretty neat. Pretty neat. So that is bag one of our live build. Live build. Thanks everyone for joining in today. President's Day surprise live build. We've got bag number two here. I so rarely get to the end cities. I kind of want to save it so that when we get there, we'll have lots of stuff to do. And they have Omni Kicks forearms too. Well, wow, that's pretty cool that they have all those Omni Kicks characters still. I have not seen them locally in my targets or anything like that. Um, so we see your comment bright and clear. Okay, what are we doing? What is this? Am I missing a piece? Oh, I I was, since I built the shulker, 
this was way back at the beginning and I was going to start rebuilding what I already built. I'm like, where's that? I'm like, oh, duh. <laughs> so I got I to gotta zoom to the future here to bag two. So we worked through all this. I am late. You're never too late in a live build because you can always run back and watch more. But this was kind of a surprise. Surprise! Live build President's Day edition. Got another figure here. Got some khaki pants. We've got a pretty cool maroonish belted piece. We've got a blonde haired dude. A little bit of a scar on the eye. And a helmet here. Maybe before I put the helmet on, let's pop this gear off. Now that we got minifigure skins built. Oh, I just broke the shield. Let's look a little closer at these figures too. Oh, this figure's head doesn't want to... There we go. Okay. Let's look at these a little closer. These are your figures included. Hello. Hello. So this one here, nice little scar on the eye. Ouch. That means uh, battler of all. This one here, a little bit of a scar on the cheek in a way. So they've both been fighting... A um, little potion on the belt of this one. And there's the backs. A little bit of a bow and arrow quiver. We built something similar to this character earlier, didn't we? With the bow and arrow from this uh, current 2020 Squeeze series. Thanks for uh, subscribing. Thanks so much, Holly. Holly Reddy, thank you so much for subscribing and watching. So, yeah, these are the two figures. I like these. These are great. These are... Um, Anytime, I mean, we have had so many years of Alex and Steve, I've probably broken record sound like that. So anytime we get a character, a new skin character for our Lego, it's so cool. And I forgot which direction the shield goes. Like that. Can I do a review of the Ben 10 toys? Um, maybe, it depends. If I can get, if I can find him, um, get that guy there. What do you think about the 1.2 update? Wow, have I seen the 1.2 update yet? Um, I'm that behind right now. I'll tell you in a week or so. Solve the cube, but please, where did the cube go? Oh, here it is. It's going to take a while. Um, I think I'll have like a short and maybe, maybe the, um, the, uh, this is such a weird cube, by the way, it kind of pulls apart, like not pulls apart, but it like, it's very mushy. It's the weirdest cube. It's fun though. Drop it there. Yes, the small swamp set with the frog. That one, I am shocked. Uh, maybe I'll open that today if we have some extra time. I have it nearby, I think. I think I have it nearby. Oh, we're building an Enderman right now. I was like, what is this? Um, I couldn't believe I did not see the frog. At first, I saw the set, and I'm like, well, that's just like, there's nothing there. And then I realized later that there was a frog in there. Building the body. I forgot the Enderman had such a large body piece when those new my singing monsters come out would you do absolutely but i don't know if they're going to come out or not i i have this horrible feeling that they canceled the series because i mean it just hit at the worst time right when covid happened and i know they weren't selling probably as well because they weren't really everywhere to be found and it's just like oh it's such a bummer i would love to see more so maybe not maybe they'll surprise us and we'll see a second series um because they were fun they were a little off tune at times and they were a little off beat but they were a lot of fun and i certainly like my, my singing monsters so the current ones i have are starting to run out of batteries i need to uh recharge them I decided to buy another ASMR octopus, and I got the rare one nicely done. The rare octopus are so tricky to find. It took me, what, those four to finally run into one? Okay, so here's the all-incredible, never-standing-very-well um, Enderman. Oh, I put the feet on. Maybe if you put the feet forward. Actually, I think that's new. They actually gave it a base. Usually, you don't get a base with your Enderman, 
So that's pretty cool. We've got a standing base and all Endermen like carrots, right? So we've got a golden carrot for him. Drop that right there. Woo! Oh, stand please. Pretty good. Coda says your squirrels are so cute and funny. Yeah, we love working with squirrels here. They're the best. Squirrels are the best. Just had International Squirrel Day. Or wait, not international. It was like uh, National Squirrel Appreciation Day. That was fun. Stand up for, you, for yourself, Enderman. <laughs> this is going to shoot out of the Ender Dragon's mouth in a minute or in a little bit. And now I'm building two of those crystal tower things. I'm surprised these weren't included in the last box, but they're being built right now. So these are gonna go way over here, I gotta reach. Oh, that's a long reach. Since when do they like carrots? I don't know. I'm wondering that myself. I like these crystal pieces. I like how they did a full two by two. I think in the past they've done one by twos, and it looked odd. I like the full, the full tower there. Kind of short, short and stumpy towers, but this isn't exactly your end battle. This is more of your end, what's it called? Arena, <laughs> end arena. These squirrels over here, we got a guy over here. What's he doing? And again, I brought this set out because I just think these two sets are so similar in, in kind of the, the two uh, player versus player theme okay so we gotta get some guys out of the way oh i just knocked over a big brain that game is very very interesting i don't think i have squirrels as a skylanders figure in my possession or i didn't look very closely says toa brony interesting a skylander squirrel i'll have to look myself I love the Killer Bunny. Yeah, the Killer Bunny made this set. Very Monty Python. Just recently rewatched, uh, well, I've seen it a million times. Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Okay, let's get this in a little closer because we're going to be kind of working on this. Um, not too many pieces left here. When you post the speed build, do Skulker versus Killer Rabbit. <laughs> Doop. Doop. I think I'm mostly finished with the 2020 Squee Minecraft sets. There's the bee cottage we've got to work on, so I gotta make some time for that one. That one I may just live build too, because both of these were perfect live builds because of the piece size. I don't want to do a live build that's like 10,000 pieces. I mean, that would be a marathon. I mean, I guess it would be kind of fun. Um, oh, I've got 66 people watching and 56 thumbs up. I, for a minute there, I thought it was equal. That was funny. Thank you, everyone, for joining in today. This is kind of fun. It was definitely a surprise. Totally, I was totally, and I was saying this earlier, if you didn't notice, um, I was like, oh, I'm going to work on some Earth Spark today. These look really cool. Everyone's saying, oh, do Earth Spark. They're awesome. And and uh, then I looked at the calendar, and I'm like, oh, wait, President's Day. Let's, let's do some, uh, let's jump in alive. Have some fun with that. What is this, an end flower? I never noticed this before. Anybody got an idea what I'm building right now? Can I talk to Playmates Toys about releasing? I don't really know my, uh, the people over at Playmates. I know one very kind person who, who occasionally sends me some turtles, but um, I don't typically get in there very often to know Playmate people. But we do have a few turtles coming. What is that, an end cactus? Anybody? What do you want to help me out with this? I, I don't get to the end very often, apparently. I need to just spend a day in the end. A flower. Okay, thanks. <laughs> it's a flower. All right, so continuing on our construction. A chorus fruit. Hmm. Is it tasty? Can you eat a chorus fruit? Man, I, I seriously have not been in the end in like over a year, maybe even two. I'm always working in the front on a squirrel build or something. 
I think this is the Ender Dragon's nose. Or it's something, all right. How is the beetroot restaurant? The beetroot restaurant is doing good. Sales are up. Sales are up. We had uh, five, five uh, soups sold. And maybe we should take a, a moment here and check out the slime and the uh, robot too. Make sure it's good. Okay. Getting there. What is going on with this? All right. This first. This is, I'm guessing, the nose. But maybe not. It's gonna, Maybe it's the head. The, this might come up like this and just keep building up. We'll see. Whatever it is, I'm having to hold and level my arms in the air, and they're getting extremely tired. My arms lifting these extremely heavy bits of brick, which aren't that, that large at all. Okay. This is definitely just about an hour build for live. I it could probably... It would probably take you like 15 minutes to throw this together if you weren't uh, focusing on a camera and everything. But yeah, it's about 15, 20 minute build, maybe half hour. Maybe, you know, you can make it an hour build if you're smart and you want to savor, because that's what I like. I like to savor if I can a build. How the Treasure X Robot Slime. We're going to check that out in just a second and see how it's doing. That's a good idea. Okay, so I'm going to build two of these. And hmm. what did I do? What did I do? Oh, okay, like this. This is weird. What did I do? Did I build this correctly? Looks like I built it correctly. Oh, it flips around and rotates. There we go. That's weird. Can I get in a little closer on this? This weird. This weird moment. You gotta flip this around. It's looking for a fun set to review. I recommend the Monkey Kid Team Hideout or the Yellow Tusk Elephant. That elephant looks really cool. I'm hoping to get to just the main uh, dragon walker mech, the main king, monkey king dragon mech. I gotta get Jay's mech fir first built, and then I can jump over to Monkey King. I'd love to get to that, hopefully. Okay, so this is pretty neat. I'm gonna rotate this around and droppeth right there. Nicely done. Omni Blast Heat. How is your day? Doing good. It's a nice President's Day. We were talking earlier at long length of our presidents. Everyone has been throwing them in. Not really, but <laughs> um, yeah, pretty good day. Oop, oop. This is a circle. This is a circle. Circle beats square. Okay. It's getting closer. We're getting really close to the final build here. I know you're sitting there really getting, oh, I want to see this built. I want to see this built, and I do too. I think it's going to be cool. It's going to be really quite interesting. You building the Lego Minecraft. Yes, this is a special live build of the End Arena right back here of the Ender Dragon head. And it's versus two characters up front fighting over that end carrot, maybe. This goes in here. And then what? Another one. One of these. The warden is just, you know, hanging out, helping too. He's a supervisor. He, it's like, it wants to know everything and what's going on, what I'm doing, how to fix this Rubik's Cube. They have Omni, not Heat Blast too out there, huh? I have not seen any of these. I'll check them out. They're probably over on Amazon, maybe. Okay. And... Doop doop. Doop doop. Doop 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 doop. Insert noise building music here. Isn't Grocery Gang a Roblox group? 
I don't know, is it? Oh, thank you for subscribing six years. That's impressive. Very impressive. I loved the Skull Arena. Is that the, the name? I'm Earlier, I'm like, what's the name of this set? And um, <laughs> the Skull Arena would be like, obviously the perfect name if that is not the name, right? So yeah, these two sets, very familiar, very um, themed perfectly together. I was saying earlier, they should just get into habit of every fall or winter, winter here, every fall, winter, fall, winter, fall, um, having a dual versus battle set. Um, kind of like they do the mechs. Every year you see Marvel mechs. Well, every year they should have one of the Minecraft sets should be a dual set because that would be fun. So this is definitely the head. We got the eyes forming here. They're looking cool. Monstrous. Oh, and this was built wrong. Got to drop down these first so that his little nose is up a little more. Got to get that nose up. All right. That's looking cool. What do you think? Looking good? You can see the mechanism for him to shoot out that piece of lava. That's what that's for. We had constructed this tiny little brick of lava and it's not too happy. Whoa, that shot pretty far for non-spring action. Actually, usually non-spring shoots far. Is the Roblox cookie man still mad at you? He's horrendously mad at me. He got, you know, he's upset because I don't sing. I don't let him sing. And I may have accidentally dropped him in the oven to eat. All right, Ender Dragon Head is coming along. I like Lego Ninjago and Star Wars sets. And sadly, this year is the last year for Lego Ninjago. Is that true? <laughs> They've said it so many times, but you're probably right. They've got to be giving it a breather soon. I absolutely love it, but... I don't know what, what, what they've got planned. They don't have any new episodes planned, I do not believe. So I probably should uh, maybe do the... Um, Uh-oh. Hmm, that's not good. Where did I use the wrong piece? Um, I probably should do like the dojo build as the final build because I've never built a Ninjago dojo house or whatever their, their headquarters. Oh, I missed up. I missed up a piece here. I'm trying to figure out where, which piece I switched with. Um, I don't really see it. That or they gave me the wrong piece. Um, anywhere in here, I'm looking for a gray two by four that isn't light gray. I'm looking for a darker two by four, but I seriously don't see one. It's hidden to my view. I thought maybe it was in here. Could be deep in here. Well, I don't think it's gonna totally, totally end the review, but we'll, um, we'll just kind of go with this. We'll all go indie with the weird dragon color ear. Somewhere in there, I messed up. I switched these two gray pieces, you can see. You can see somewhere inside, there's a dark gray piece. I gotta flip them out. Ninjago isn't over there, coming out with new series crystallized was the end of an era like Avengers Endgame. Okay, that's good to hear. That's good to hear. I feel like it's Ninjago's their mascot, and I can understand if Lego needed a year or something to kind of cool it down and uh, finish out and then start it back up. But these Ninjago characters are basically uh, Lego's Mickey Mouse. Okay. Is that the shulker head or someone's helmet? Have you played Crossy Roads before? Yeah, I played Crossy Road. I have Crossy Castle on my uh, phone right now, too. I like Crossy Castle. Oh, gosh. Sorry, Enderman. Crossy Castle is pretty cool. Okay, drop that in there. We need to build a potion somewhere along the way. I got all this extra gear. What is going on? Oh, Ah, uh, see these, oh, what happened here? Got two of these. So we can kind of repair the color ear there, but I'm not, I'm gonna leave it as is for now. So somewhere along the way, I put in a two by two by four instead of putting in a, a two by two, double two by two. And we'll build up the potion here, boop. 
Ninjago City Markets. Oh, really? Another? Oh, man, that was such a beautiful set. I don't, I don't, unfortunately, have much room for the large builds anymore. I'm completely running out of space. They take up so much area. And, okay, so who gets what? This guy gets the, the shield. I didn't get them mixed up. I dropped, got the shield down a little bit. I'm waiting to turn this around for the reveal. I'm just like, you guys are sitting there going, I want to see it. I, 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 almost, almost ready. Um, and then I want to get this figure ready. This figure has the enchantments. The bow, which is always the hardest thing to get onto these figures' hands. Does anyone else have trouble doing this? Someone said the time twins are coming back. Ooh, interesting. I remember those guys. I built their snake. It's going to be the biggest Ninjago set. $370! I think the, the City Gardens was like $275. I thought that was a great deal for what it was. Fantastic, fun build. Okay, we are good to go. What is this? Is that an extra carrot piece? I think so. So these are all extra pieces. These two, I'm going to have to... Oh, wait, wait. No, never mind. <laughs> These two pieces, I'm going to have to figure out eventually where they go to switch some things out. And are you ready for the reveal? Are you ready to see the dragon spun around? Here it comes. Here it comes. Watch slowly as everyone drops out in the, the stream now because they'll be like, okay, saw it. Next. Um, there it is. There's the giant... Uh, and the end arena with Ender Dragon. And we'll place this lobule of lava up in its nose. And we'll get in a little closer here. Pretty good set. Stands pretty tall. Taller than a warden. And it's a good display piece because these are great for, like, display your um, Minecraft figures. So you could take all the skins from this current series and use this as a display set. We've got our trap, our lava trap, ah, lava trap, ah. So if our character is standing there, I don't know who activates the lava trap, the mighty ender dragon head. And oh, burns, it burns. Now I'm going to dance for you. Oh, ah, it's the burning lava dance. Oh, and now you got hit in the head with lava. Ouch, this person is not having a good day. So there's two traps. There's the, obviously, there's the door trap, and then there's this lava sh shot trap where you just tap it and it shoots out the back. Pretty neat. And according to the box here, we have a character kind of, well, that's not a character. Yeah, here's one of the characters. We've got the plant cactus fighting <laughs> this guy. Uh, no, not the plant cactus. The plant cactus goes down here. And oh, I dropped this person, this poor guy. Ah, oh, his leg, his leg. Get on there. And they can battle it out. Let's close this trap door. Where does the shulker go? Shulker goes up front. Again, that is a cool, that is a cool piece. There's several things of this set that are like call outs to be awesome. Wait, is that upside down? Yeah, it is upside down. His head's on, uh, what? Okay, well, we'll just go with that. That goes there. Oh, this block needs to be moved over by two. Plant Cactus beats the ward and the Ender Dragon and the Bedrock Wither. Yeah, I'm going to have to do something with Plant Cactus. Expect like a little short of Plant Cactus taking out... Ah, this guy's so hard. Taking out everybody because he's kind of funny. <laughs> I like Plant Cactus quite a bit. Where does the potion go? Uh, the potion, I guess, is kind of what they're fighting over. Um, back in the End Skull Arena... Listen, Landry fell over... Um, back in the end school arena, they fought over the golden apple. So now they're fighting over the golden carrot. This was, oh, this is a few years old now. This set was maybe, you'll have to check the review. I'll put the link up in the, the description when the live's done where and when this set, I built this, but four years, five years now? It's been a while, and it's one of my favorites. It's one that sat on um, a shelf really close by. I had to do one of these today because it was really dusty, but it cleaned up nicely. But it's one of my favorites just because it has like this, the green and the blue spawn area, which is kind of fun. I kind of wish they incorporated that with this set, like a, a little spawn pad. So like after they fight, he dies and comes back to life. 
and then spawns back in for battle. I love how these little things are floating almost on the lava. They look like they're raised above. You got your apple here. I can't remember if the apple goes there or I think it goes in this chest actually. It might go in there. And you got the killer bunny. So the killer bunny versus the killer shulker versus the plant cactus here. <laughs> Plant cactus and cactus is, you know, one of the most feared things. Uh, don't worry about the ender dragon or skulkers or shulkers or whatever. Worry about this guy. He's monstrous. And then, of course, the warden back there. He's got some problems, too. So that, my friends, is the enderino. What do you think? Pretty cool. Got to fix it a little bit. A couple errors in there on my part. Uh, there's the mechanism from the back again. Closing and opening that door. Hey, Squirrel Stampede, what's your favorite game? I got lots of favorite games. Minecraft, of course, is always going to be something I go back, come back to because it's so creative. Um, I enjoy that one quite a bit. Currently, I'm playing on my phone that egg game with the chickens where you grow eggs. A little bit of Frozen City. That one's fun. Anyone play Frozen City? Those are cell phone games. Those are fun. Roblox is always, always great. I played, I played so much Bee Swarm over the holidays. Oop, it was crazy. So that's another great game. That's a cool set. This is a really cool set. It'd be fun to get some extra pieces and build up, mod up uh, the back end of this dragon. So you got this set is 252 pieces. So then if you invest in like, like 2000 more pieces, you could build the rest of the dragon. <laughs> So, and then do all that extra work. Did you make a video about the $9 Swamp Adventure set? I did not. I'm looking over my shoulder to see where it is. Hang on. It should be right here. Well. Wait, wait, wait. Thank you for reminding me, by the way. Thank you for reminding me. Let's build it. Let's just add it in, even though my voice is going. Um, we're gonna try to add this in really quick because I don't know when I will add this, add that in. Drink some water really quick. Have I ever sold any Lego? Um, not too often, occasionally. I have everything binned up. Something's displayed, something's binned per theme. I have a huge Nexo Knight collection. I'm still trying to decide what to do with. I love them, but they take up a lot of space. Yeah, Mega and Lego have typically uh, had SpongeBob back and forth. Do you like any of the Lego idea sets? Yeah, they're great. I like the new A-frame. Um, house. That's pretty cool. Okay, so this is set number 21240, The Swamp Adventure. So I'm glad you mentioned this for me to bring it out. This is a perfect time to bring and build this set. Pop that up there. There's so much going on here. So there is that little book of instructions. We're all here for the frog and maybe the slime cube. That's just as cool. So there's our pieces, only 70, 65 pieces, so very short build. It's an Alex build, so they do find ways to keep Alex, and I, I don't mind having them appear once in the series. Why not? Um, they're such crucial character builds. Um, I see someone's purple pants. That must be the zombies. Or, oh no, oh no. Our fears have been confirmed. Plant cactus now has limbs. What are we gonna do? Plant cactus, I can't find Alex's feet, so I'm gonna give Alex this crafting table and we're just gonna get going here. Lego Legacy Heroes Unbox is shutting down. Feels like forever since seeing diamond armor in these sets. Seems like they always just give us just a little bit of something. Just a little bit of something. 
So everybody, now we're just extending the live build just a tad because we're having so much fun. And we're gonna add in this set right here, this really cool build. We haven't seen the frog yet. There's the frog. I'll just let you sit on the lava for a second. Oh no, it's hot, it's hot. Oh, sorry, don't do that. Um, lily pad. This piece is stuck, this tile is stuck. What do you think about reprints in minifigures? Well, it depends. I can tell you the story of my Lego Minecraft witch. I built the Lego witch hut about five years ago. And then one day the witch decided to fall off her perch and she landed in a box in my office studio and that piece is not coming out. Um, how am I gonna get that out How about this? And I could not find the witch for years. And then I find out that that witch was only produced a couple times, if not just once. And it cost like $70 to get a replacement Lego witch. But then it cost $2 to get a fake knockoff witch. So I got the fake knockoff witch. And she was a stand-in for a while. And then finally, one day, I was going through my Mega Constructs um, Pokemon sets that I had not built. I had a few series I had not built, and the witch had fallen in there. I would have never expected her to fall in there. And so, finally I found the witch, and I was much happier, because I kept looking at new LEGO Minecraft sets going, is there a witch? Is there a witch? Because if there was going to be a witch, I was going to buy three of those sets. But now I don't have to do that, because I found the witch. And that is my story of the time I lost my Lego Minecraft witch. So to answer your question about reprints, I don't mind it. It's hard when there's a favorite character you'd like to see. But then at the same time, sometimes it's fun to have that one character. Like today, I was I could have sworn I had a Lego movie Abraham Lincoln minifigure. And maybe I do, and I just was looking in the wrong spot, but I could have sworn I might have had one, and I couldn't find one, so now I'm looking around for one, and I think it's going to cost me at least 40 bucks if I ever go that way. That was a long story. How does this go? What? What in the name of all fun things? That's weird. Does that just like hover right there? Did I do that right? That's really weird. And then that's gonna, sh oh, it's stuck. That just locked itself in. That's gotta be a building, an illegal building technique. Or is it? Okay, so I'm gonna rotate this around. And I can't see, the, the print on this, this sheet is weird. Look at it, it's like all like ghosted. Something happened, the print is hurting my eyes. I'm looking at it and I'm like, what happened? What happened there? Teach me, wise one, how to make such great videos. I'm still trying to figure that out myself, to be honest. I don't know how to do what I'm doing half the time. Just do it, that's, that's the trick, just do it. Have fun, build, discover, play. Ooh, rotate. Plant cactus is gonna have to fight blue, blue flower soon. Oh, our frog can sit on its lily pad. That's so cute. Let's look at it closer. So here's our Lego frog, my first frog ever. I almost missed this set. I saw it. And I'm like, it's just a swamp. Who cares? And then I'm like, oh, the frog. Can't can't not get the frog. Okay, so now I need to build our what? 10th, 100th, 10th, 100th, is that a number? A, another crafting table. We've done many crafting tables over the years. So we got that. And up front here. This is gonna bridge across the swamp. It's always so muddy. Why is the swamp so muddy? Anyone figure that out yet? I can place this set near the witch's hut now that I found my witch and I have that backup witch. So, you know, 
things aren't all bad. Uh, man, I've had some bad luck with little uh, tiles getting stuck in my bricks today. Yeah, it seems like we lost about 10 people when I finished that, and they are missing out. They're going to be like, oh, you totally missed out on the build for the frog swamp. This set, I think, would have like been so much cooler had they put like five frogs in it. Almost done. Oh, and we are going to test out the slime. He's right by my desk. You see it in the videos all the time behind me. <laughs> Everybody wants to know how the slime is doing. This guy got a little dusty. He's a great shelf companion over there. Okay. Slime. How is the slime doing? Here we go, everybody. It's a pretty good seal, so I'm feeling like it's good. Look at that, it's become the shape of the bottom of the seal. The slime is good. The oil consistency is still good. It lives on. So we'll close that up and keep it nice and protected. Okay, continuing on, enough segueing. My voice is gonna go out any minute now. One of these. One of those. It's always hard to do vines. I have the toughest time with vines. Okay, goes there. I have not seen Nia's water dragon. I gotta look again. I gotta look again. And that's an interesting scam story on uh, Adopt Me. Zzzz. TNT block. Well, at least they threw in some interesting items. Interesting TNT block here. Adding the set certainly added this going past an hour. Just this little extra build here. Oh, there's Alex's legs. Oh, and I built the TNT wrong. Do you, I can't believe how many times I've messed the TNT up. Every time I mess it up. Almost every time. It's so weird. Okay. Who's the biggest bird in Minecraft? It's a weird question. The mechanism's cool because you can make it look like it's eating a large frog. Hmm. And Alex has got one of these. I have no idea what happened to the zombie's legs. So the zombie is just going to be like pulled into the lava right now. And there is our neat little swamp piece. A little extra bonus for today's President Day live build. Let's pop a TNT block. Put up. That was so anticlimactic. Try it again, a little harder. Whoa, almost caught that. One more time. Third time's a charm. Get it from this angle right here. One, two, three. Oh, almost hit the Pachirisu. It's a nice little thing there. And our frog. So, pretty cute little build. This runs, I think it's under 10. I think you can still get a Lego set under $10. But if you want that cute little frog piece, that's the, that's the bonus. That's the bonus right there. All right, so that is the two builds today. We got the end arena constructed up. We've got a little bit of the swamp adventure. Thank you everybody so much for jumping in on this surprise live build squirrel stampede today. Uh, I will link up in the video this uh, for your amusement. Check out the Dragonite build from this week. Amazing, and I'm gonna start looking into these this week. Uh, I'm not sure when I'll drop the video. It might be Friday. Actually, I got a lot of stuff to do. So um, those Transformers Earth Sparks coming soon. 
Uh, it's been a pleasure to talk with you today and chat and have fun. Hopefully another live video will drop in the future because this one was pretty successful. I enjoyed everyone's banter. Thank you so much for watching. That's what I have to say about that.